I want to be able to do this. You know, like, I want to be able to live in a fucking tent or, you know, just live outside. And again, it just makes me think about Peace Pilgrim. Like, was her story even true? It straight wouldn't surprise me if it wasn't. Like, genuinely, like, I was always kind of, um, suspicious that the Peace Pilgrim story was just, like, made up, you know, or just, like, fucking lies or something, but in the same token, I feel like it wasn't because she talked about walking across the North Atlantic island of Newfoundland in, like, the late 50s, I think it was. And it's like the way that she described it was like totally right on, you know. Because I've been there a lot and I know how it is, you know. It's like what she said about it seemed like she really had been there, you know what I mean? It's like, I don't know. Yeah, it just seems like it just really does. It seems like seems like she had been there, you know, and so, it's like, I want to believe the story, like, I want to believe she really walked through all these places, you know, over the course of, like, 30 years, but it's just like, did she really, you know, it's just like, sleeping in bushes and shit, and under overpasses, and like, you know, supposed to be my Peace Pilgrim walk, you know what I mean, but... Peace Pilgrim was, like, way happier than me. You know what I mean? And it's like, if the Peace Pilgrim story was true, she just had one set of clothes. It's like, you know, you can see a, a pair of her shoes on the internet. There's pictures of them, you know. It's like... You know, they were worn out. And it's just like... If she only had one outfit, like... When did she ever change? Like, when did she ever do the laundry? You know, when did she bathe? It's like... You know, I don't necessarily believe in doing any of that. But I'm just saying, like, how did she do it? You know, where are the fucking details of Peace Pilgrim's actual journey? I mean, she has a book. Maybe I should, like, read it. <laughs> you know? Like, admittedly, I've never read it or anything. But it's just like... You know... Where are the fucking stories? Where's the story of her, like, being invited into somebody's house? And then, like, you know, they say, well, you want us to do your laundry? And then she's like, okay, you know, and then wear this robe while we do your laundry, you know? I mean, did that ever happen? I mean, I just the little things. It's the little things, you know? And it's like, you would think... You know, ducking behind a bush and fucking sleeping for the night is, like, a big fucking deal. And that she would at least have a couple stories. 
about having done that. You know, she'd be like, one time I slept behind a bush and, you know, this, this, and this happened or whatever. You know what I mean? It's like, where are the stories? Like, I love Peace Pilgrim and I love the concept, you know, but I feel like there are unanswered questions. I certainly have unanswered questions about it. It's just like whether or not this happened in the 50s, in the 60s, in the 70s, in the 80s. There should be a lot more, like, documentation of it, you know? There should be a lot more stories about it and pictures and, you know, all kinds of stuff that show her life more, you know, show the journey more. I mean, are there really, is there really no, no proof? It's like, it's like, yeah, I want proof. I want proof Peace Pilgrim really did do it. It was claimed that she did. It's like, where are the stories from people who saw her? You know, where are the pictures of her with people? You know? I'm not saying the story is made up. Like, why would... Why would they make up a story like that? You know what I mean? I'm not saying that. It's just... There's just not adequate proof or evidence for me. I mean, there's hardly even any stories. There are hardly even any stories. Where are the stories? You know, where were her stories? And it bothers me because... I feel like a lot of the lack of sharing was excused by and passed off as... Being part of the selfless, you know, um, nature of what she was doing or, like, her message or whatever, you know. It's, like, a lot of the lack of stories and sharing and details is because of that, I feel. Because she lived it, right? So, where are her stories, She had some, don't get me wrong, but not many. 
like aside from one story that she told about how she almost froze to death one night and miraculously made it to an underpass where there was a cardboard box and she survived, you know. It's like that that's that's like the only story that she literally that I have ever heard her tell or anything that has to do with sleeping somewhere. Like, you know, she 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 basically never fucking addressed these topics. Pretty much never. I guess it just bothers me because a life as absolutely remarkable and special a life that unique and that full of experiences it just should have been better documented it should have been shared you know and It never will be. It never will be. Never will be now. We'll never know, like, 99% of Peace Pilgrim's actual experiences. Ever. That's why I love the internet so much, is because Peace Pilgrim today... Maybe she'd have been on YouTube, you know? Maybe there would have been, even even if she wasn't, maybe there would have been people, you know, uh, seeing Peace Pilgrim walk through their town and going and taking pictures. You know, Peace Pilgrim's walking by my house. Oh, my God, you know, run out there, take a selfie with Peace Pilgrim, you know? Like, record a clip of Peace Pilgrim walking past your house. Oh, my God, it's Peace Pilgrim, you know? It's like, today... Whether she had put her own self out there or not, you know, she'd have been put out there. You know, it would be out there. It would be documented, right? And because of the internet, people, you know, would have their stories, right? Even if they didn't have pictures or anything, they would be sharing their stories of having seen Peace Pilgrim, you know? But we'll never have any of that. How many times does a peace pilgrim happen? <sighs> Not very often, dude. <sighs>